Today is the two-year anniversary of the horrifying Boston Marathon bombing, but it is being remembered as a day of service and kindness. VUTV reporter Nikita Sempop is live near the finish line of the Boston Marathon with more on how the Boston mayor and the public are observing this day. Early this morning, Mayor Marty Walsh unveiled this honorary banner at 755 Boylston Street. The Richard family was with him. People are still coming by and leaving flowers at the base of this lamppost. The mayor himself spent all morning visiting first responders and donation drives all around the city. Today marks two years since the Boston Marathon bombing. It also marks the beginning of a new tradition, one Boston day. Well, today is the anniversary of the Boston Marathon bombings, which was an incredible tragedy in this community, and people want to do something good. One of the ways you can help others and give back to the community is by rolling up your sleeve and giving blood. So we find that our donors look forward to this day because it's a day to just celebrate Boston strong and to come together for a good cause, and that's helping save lives. Mayor Marty Walsh announced that today will be a day for giving back to the community a day that will stand for the strength, generosity, and the resilience of the city of Boston. Uh, it's been unbelievable so far. I mean, I've, the hotels and everyone's really been very excited about it, and I've seen a lot of, a lot of activity out there, so it's good so far. And, it, you know, everything I've read or heard about so far, it's only, you know, it's still early in the morning, but people are really, really, you know, happy doing things. The American Red Cross were able to provide 600 units of blood to the victims of the 2013 bombing. We want to do something nice to the community to reward and appreciation to the people of Boston and uh, people in Cambridge and the MIT and also our first responders. So we want to dedicate to them to show them uh, the uh, positive thing. That's the most important way. At 2.49 p.m. this afternoon, the exact moment that the bombs went off two years ago, uh, the city of Boston will observe a moment of silence to remember the victims and the survivors of the bombing. Back to you, Keiko.